Look at this photo. Don't you think that something is wrong here? And if we add beard, then everything falls into place. And here is the first step of how to glow up as soon as possible. Grow a beard. Of course, if only it grows fully and thickly. You don't have to try to be as Kratos if your genetics tells you. It's too early. Way out of this situation. Clean shave. Win with what you have. Maybe Wall Street style will suit you. Make a classic hairstyle to correct your face shape and a poorly growing beard will ruin everything. Okay, you got lucky and decided to grow it out, but that's only half the story. Next, you need to take good care. Use oils and visit the barber regularly. The second step is good sunglasses. Guys, adding classic frames to your look will boost your attractiveness by 10 levels. I personally am a fan of brown and grey frames and you should try them too, they suit everyone. The main thing is to make sure that the glasses are ideal in size and it emphasizes your face shape. Sunglasses are visible to everyone and your eyes are your health, so I advise you not to save much on them. Invest in very high quality shades. Guys, join my Patreon. There you will find a lot of exclusive content such as ebooks, training programs, diet plans, style guides, and podcasts. You can chat with me, I will answer all your questions. Get the How to Glow Up ebook free for seven days. Offer is limited. Link below. The third is haircut. I'll be brief here because in another video on this topic will be released soon. I'll give you a simple tip, no fades. Grow out the sides, try timeless scissor haircuts. They are perfect for any age, wardrobe and face shape. Side part, slick back and executive hairstyles are the best options. The fourth tip is to say less. Bro, I know you have a lot to say to others, but sometimes silence is golden. Moreover, do not talk about your future dreams and plans because you will be disappointed. Only you should know about it. When you speak, you must gain good. And when you remain silent, avoid bad. Talk less, work more. And even when in bar meeting with friends, you have to be able to hold the line and filter your words. Do not regret what was said, say less. Tip number five, shave your armpits. Sometimes you see a well-dressed guy in a white t-shirt, but as soon as he raises his arms, unshaven jungle bulges out of his armpits. Armpits are one of the sweatiest and polluted areas of the body and hair is highly absorbent of odor and dirt. Always stay well-groomed. Pay attention to your armpits. Sixth, use the fragrance correctly. Don't overflow with the bottle making five puffs. You kill all the beauty of the smell and repel those around you. No matter how much your fragrance costs, apply it very carefully. A maximum of two puffs will suffice for daily use. Also, I do not recommend applying to the decollete and neck area, since there the skin ages the fastest, and perfumes contain alcohol, which dries your skin and leads to premature wrinkles. The wrists behind the ears and shoulders are best suited. Seven, stay simple. When you choose clothes, focus on minimalism, quality of materials, and fit. No need to try to prove that you supposedly know how to dress. Notice this line. No need to scream with your clothes that you have money. The most basic items without logos but made of quality materials. This is a wardrobe worth a million. You will never look cheap in a nice white t-shirt and dark trousers. But at the same time, this is what I call quiet chic because others will notice you first of all and not what you are wearing. Nothing beats simplicity when it comes to wardrobe. Eighth advice, cure your teeth. Dental health is very important. Visit the dentist at least two times a year for a comprehensive oral examination. There is no person with perfect healthy teeth, especially for us men. Cleaning and flossing is fine, but that's just basic care. You need professional treatment. Treat your teeth now so you won't regret it in the future. Yes, in many countries, the services of a dentist are expensive, I understand that. But nevertheless, having spent 500 bucks now, you will save thousands because you still have to treat your teeth sooner or later. You don't need a new iPhone yet, cure your teeth. Tip number nine, keep your place clean. Whether it's a room, apartment, or office, always try to clean frequently. Turn on the music and completely sort your wardrobe. Vacuum a pool and just get rid of unnecessary things. Keep your clothes clean, your bed made, and your house neat. It's easy and only takes a few minutes. And I will give you personal advice. Room sprays and diffusers are life changers. Do you want to feel at home like in an expensive hotel? Then try home fragrances, you will like it. And the 10th is vocabulary. Read more books, watch more movies. Increase your vocabulary to speak beautifully without parasitic words. Use less jargons. Convey your thoughts clearly and literally. I'm not telling you to become a bore who always uses buzzwords to no avail. Just be able to replace something with rarely used synonyms. 